good morning all my dear students so let's get started with our second term syllabus in which we are going to read today chapter number 8 from your english reader that is donating human organs is supreme sharing organ transplantation as we all know is a very successful treatment for those who suffer from organ failure organ donation can save many lives so it is rightly said that donating organs is supreme sharing so let us read out and find find more about it first of all what is organ donation organ donation is the donation of various organs of the human body from a living or a dead person to a living person in need of a transplant so it is believed that the organs can from one donor can save as many 50 lives so one even a dead person can save as many as 50 lives most organs and biological tissues of the human body are donated after the donor has died or has been declared technically dead but in some cases tissues can be donated while the donor is still alive as it happens in case of kidney transplantation or eye transplantation now organ donation is one of the greatest boons of modern science in past when surgery was not so developed no one could think of this kind of donation but now every good hospital fully equipped to meet any kind of emergency arising in delicate operations can boast of providing this organ transplantation facility now organ tran- organ donation is a highly rewarding act both for the donor as well as the recipient it gratifies the donor to make him or her think that they have saved the lives of their near and dear ones and the recipients to think they will once again be in, be in a position to lead a normal life like other able bodied persons now according to certain religions of the world organ donation is like a continuous charity for example if a blind person receives another person's eye to be able to see it is like a continuous charity it is a continuous charity because even after the donor's death the benefit of donation of his or her eye continues to be received by another person now when you donate any organ of your body while living or after death you show the greatest sympathy to the recipient of that organ in this way organ donation promotes compassion for others and a noble human spirit in society when you donate your body organs or biological tissues you don't lose anything on the contrary you make the recipient so happy and grateful to you that their happiness can be compared with the happiness on being blessed with millions and billions of dollars and tons of golds and diamond organ donation is not merely a donation but it is a kind of a sharing that god has given to each one of us free of cost with those who are not as fortunate as we are so every human organ being a free gift of nature organ donation is like a divine donation some people here may argue that organ donation is a disfigurement of the human body and as such it should not be allowed in this connection it is worth remembering that disfigurement always involves some kind of ill intention on the part of the person who causes it and as such it is always unlawful but organ donation does not have any such bad intention on the part of the persons involved in it neither the recipient nor the donor rather they both equally share the ecstasy the happiness of giving and receiving the gifts of nature so organ donation is purely an act of good intention on the part of the donor it is carried out with a noble intention for the benefit of fellows so for a human being treating organ donation at par with disfigurement of the human body would be a big mistake and most unfair to the cause of universal brotherhood so it is high time we have positive thinking on the subject of organ donation to make this world a place of love compassion and cooperation removing hatred and unhealthy competition at every step in life so i hope you all must have understood this chapter so just go through it once again and in the next lesson we shall discuss the question answers of the same so till then just read read it carefully and stay safe 
and attend all your classes regularly. Thank you and have a nice day.